Hello, World of Tank Blitzers. It's Littlefinger. Hey, on Mayan Ruins here. This is a quick replay game that I decided to go ahead and show. Since I haven't been showing much of my own content lately, we're in the IS-4. This is my favorite tier 10 tank, and this game basically exemplifies the reason why I love this tank so much. So, Anyway, I uh, hope you guys are enjoying this new 5.3 update. I'm getting this new mass, map Faust all the time, really loving it. Um, heavies here have pushed up the left side of the map, and the IS-7, I can see here, he's getting ready to side scrape. So I'm like, all right, dude, you can have that corner. Um, I can't do much if you're just going to sit on the corner there. But I did a quick peek there, and he is moving on. Um, but anyway, I've committed now to coming around through the middle. T110E4, um, not going to get that shot to go in, but uh, just want to get to the other side here in safety. And uh, you'll notice one of the new things with this 5.3 update in the left-hand side there. Uh, in orange is the amount of damage that I've done in the game, and in gray is the amount of damage that I have successfully blocked. And I want you to keep an eye on that number as it's... Uh, it's a pretty amazing number in this game, if you ask me. So anyway, the IS-7 is pushed up, got himself in trouble, and uh, silly me going in to help him out. But I'm going to get myself in front of this T110E5, and uh, he bounces, but uh, obviously there is someone with an auto loader down there uh, taking shots at me. And you can see, with all of this, 1,660 blocked already. Um, we did a bad job aiming there to get our shot to go in, so we're in a reload. He bounces another shot. Um, I'm caught on fire. I have no equipment to put that out with. Um, but uh, you can see here, we just got this T110E5 flustered. 2,700 block damage already. And um, so this is the point in the game here. You can see my engine's damaged. Uh, I'm not moving as well. I'm still waiting on uh, all of my equipment there to allow me to repair. Um, and it's four on three. Um, the T-57 Heavy down there. And I don't know why uh, you guys decide to chase a T-57 Heavy. I mean, with a full magazine, you know, he's going to light you guys up. Um... I thought about running down there, but with only half an engine here, I decided not to. The E100 comes up, and we get a nice shot there into his trunk track. And you can see the IS-7 is even telling the FV to back up. I mean, there's no point. Um, and here's a quick hint. It took me a little bit to switch over to heat there. If you're an E100 driver, do not point your turret at uh, the opposing tank you want to keep that thing angled so I can't put that heat straight in again um, now it's three on one um, and these guys have just pushed up way too hard but again here's the reason I love this IS-4 we've got the T-57 he's reloaded now um, he bounces that shot and uh, he's gonna wisely get behind this tank but uh, he's a little bit taller and all I have to do is switch over to HE and we'll get this shot to go into the top of his turret there. Now it's one on one. Um, I should be okay with 945 hit points here, but I don't want to uh, jeopardize it. But look at this damage blocked, 3,570. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of just slow playing this E100 here. Uh, obviously not the best player. Um, and so we can put a heat shot right there into the side of the turret. And uh, probably could have switched over to HE to finish him off for the last shot. But, uh, you know, he's not even moving that turret or wiggling or anything. Um, so we'll just go ahead and finish him off there. For the Klobinoff, um, we ended up doing 3,743 in damage. Of course, steel wall. Um, damage blocked, obviously legendary there. It's way over 200 percent um but uh you know that just exemplifies why this tank i just love this tank it's so mobile um i'm almost as fast as that is7 if you notice at the beginning of the game 
Uh, he did overtake me there towards the end. Um, but it's a very mobile tank. It's a lovely heavy tank, and um, the gun is real good on it. So, again, guys, I uh, hope you guys are having fun out there. I hope you're enjoying the new map like I am. And, of course, get educated, not fingered. Little finger out.